Hi, I'm Yaram Yunaiman and I'm a member of our support team at Groby Optimization. Thank you for watching the video on alternative license locations where I will walk you through the issue of Groby not finding your license file, although you certainly have downloaded the file to your machine. This video is part of a series of introductory and support videos to guide new users to getting started with Groby and some of the most frequently asked support questions. You can find links to all of our videos in the comments below. As you can see here, I have downloaded a Groby license file and stored it in a folder which I created for it. However, when I try to execute Groby in the command line, I get an error indicating that no license has been found. The reason for this is that Groby searches for a license file in a specific default location which is different from the folder I created for the license file. You can find a link to a knowledge base article describing all license file default locations in the video description. Still, I would like to use this non-default license file location. In order to do so, I have to set the corresponding environment variable called grb license file. This environment variable is pointing to the location of the grb license file I want to use. From the command line, on Mac and Linux, you can set the variable via the export command. In Windows, you have to use the set command. Now that the environment variable is set manually, I am able to execute Kurobi. Unfortunately, setting of the environment variable is only active for the current command window, meaning that I would have to repeat the process every time I open a new command window. This can be circumvented by setting the environment variable in the operation system settings. Nevertheless, we strongly recommend to place the license file at one of the default locations to avoid unnecessary IT work and directly start to work with Kurobi. Thank you. I hope you found this video helpful. Please check out the other videos in the series for installation guides and getting started.